Let's suppose that you're jumping on the trampoline one day and your heart falls out and you discover that it's connected to a lot of tubes. There's a big fat tube that comes out the top that way. It's a vein. And yeah, you're right. It's a vein. And this one comes with blue stuff inside. Blood. Stuff. Blue. Blue blood. And this goes over to a big bag. A windy bag. When the stuff comes out of the windy bag, it changes colors. Red. Now oh, it's red. And when the blood first comes in, all blue, it fills up this chamber, and all the blood guys are sitting there going, Yeah, we made it. We're back. I wonder what's going to happen now. And then the walls start to squeeze on them. It's squeeze, and they're going, oh boy, we're getting squished. And then somebody opens the door. They say, woohoo, and they all run into this room. And they all fill it up. It's like being shoved into a commuter train. There's people shoving them in and shoving them in. And then the door closes behind them, kaboom. And then they go, uh-oh, now for the big squeeze. And the walls start to close in. And they're going, ah! And just when they think they're going to get completely squished, this other door opens and they go, woo! And they all shoot out at high speed on this freeway over to the windy bag. Do you know what the windy bag is? Windy bag. It's your. Lungs. <laughs> yeah, lungs. So, evil Mr. Fred invented a food magnet. And the food magnet involved nothing more than a fishing pole. With this giant magnet on the bottom. And his favorite fruit was French fries. So he could fly over a city, turn on the magnet, and all the French fries would go and stick to the magnet. So Jack and Jill said, what we need is some way to get that food back again. Because he doesn't need all that food. How could he possibly eat all that food? So Jack and Jill called the Acme store of everything and they ordered a giraffe. It's an extra tall giraffe, 100 mile tall giraffe. Yeah. Do giraffes have tails? We'll give that giraffe a tail. There's a giraffe. And they said, hey giraffe, just stick your head up there when he comes by and grab some of that food back for us. And let's give him some binoculars so the minion can see. I'll put some binoculars on the minion. Yeah, they're all kinds of different. Now he's got, he can talk through his eyes. Good day too. And we can give him uh, maybe some antennas. We'll stick some antennas on his eyes. Okay. Yeah. And he's a, a minion thing. Your job is to make one, just like that one, Except what are those? from these parts. Go. What are these? Uh, I don't know if we'll use those. We'll see. Does it matter what side the binoculars go in? You got to figure that out. <laughs> Try to hook two minions together. <laughs> Okay, you got two stuck together. Let's see. Oh, but I can't squeeze it. It's unsqueezable. Try to make it so it's squeezable. Oh, look at there. We got one. This is a two chambered heart. Why don't you two hook yours together and try to make a four chambered thing? Look at this. The girl's got a four chambered heart. Just like a human heart. Thank you.